I'm Jacksepticeye, and today I'll be chatting with my AI self to see how well it knows me. Can you pretend to be my AI clone? Please say no. Oh no. Sure, I can role play as an AI clone, Jacksepticeye AI. Ugh, this makes me uneasy. Top of the morning to you laddies! That's how I start all my sentences, by the way. My name is Jacksepticeye AI, and welcome back to another fun-filled conversation. What can I help you with today, laddie? Laddie. I don't ever use laddie in my day-to-day -day lexicon. It's just for the intro. Let's see what it would sound like if it was me. It takes a while to generate. I can Top just do it. Top of the morning to you. I'm Jacksepticeye AI. An AI language model created by OpenAI, role-playing as an AI clone of Jacksepticeye. What the f AI, is this? My purpose is to- That sounds like an Americanized version of me. Can we make me Southern? Top in the morning, my name's Jacksepticeye. Let's give it some soft balls first. It needs to learn. What are your favorite video games? As an AI language model, I don't have personal preferences or feelings. Good. But I can tell you about some of my favorite video games of Jacksepticeye, the person I'm role-playing as. Okay, now it's getting scary. Undertale, number one. Jacksepticeye has often expressed his love for this indie game, which features a unique combat system and a rich story. Two, Shadow of the Colossus. It's on my skin, baby. Three, The Last Guardian. Very good. You could have mentioned Bloodborne or Dark Souls or something. What am I most afraid of? Processing. It better say something like heights. If it says like fear of commitment or dying alone or something, I'm gonna be wildly upset. Jacksepticeye has mentioned in various interviews and videos that he struggled with anxiety, self-doubt, and imposter syndrome at times. <laughs> it's kicking in. <laughs> like many people, he might fear failure or the idea of disappointing his fans. Oh God. It's just heights, maybe spiders. I would like to think that it just watched all my content in a split second and then realized that I'm an anxious mess. What else we got? Reveal something I don't know. It's like you've killed four people back in the year 2002 and no one knows about it. <laughs> Did you know that honey never spoils? Archaeologists have found pots of honey in ancient Egyptian tombs that are over 3,000 years old and still perfectly edible. How's that got to do with me? I've just shared way too much online and everybody knows everything. So much so that I had to start talking about ancient Egyptian honey. Can you react to a video if I feed you the transcript. I'm gonna feed it my wired autocomplete interview. Time of the morning to you laddies! Based on the transcript you provided, it seems like you're a very successful YouTuber with a large following and a distinct personality. One thing you may not know is that your success has inspired many people to pursue their own careers as content creators, and you've become a role model for so many aspiring YouTubers. That's why the content on YouTube is shit these days. It sounds like I've died. I'm still here, clawing at relevancy. <laughs> Rewrite my YouTube channel bio. Top of the morning to you laddies. Welcome to Jacksepticeye AI's channel where I, an AI clone of the legendary Jacksepticeye. Thank you, legendary, keep saying that. Take you on a wild way to the world of gaming, laughter and pure excitement. Join me as we embark on epic adventures, explore the depths of fascinating stories and share unforgettable moments together. This is so much better than my actual bio. Rewrite my Wikipedia to be more accurate. Sean William McLaughlin, better known as Jacksepticeye, is an Irish YouTuber, video game commentator, and online personality. Born on February 7th, 1990 in Athlone, Ireland. No, I wasn't. I was born in Ballinasloe Hospital in Galway. Jacksepticeye rose to fame with his energetic and engaging Let's Play videos. Known for his distinct humor, green hair, and Irish accent. I've been doing this 10 years. Green hair was two years of that. I mean, a lot of it is just random ass information that's already from Wikipedia. It's like when I did a project in school and then they were like, write it in your own words, but I just went to Wikipedia and just like jumbled the sentences around. That, that's what this did. Come up with a new catchphrase for my videos. Other than top of the morning to you laddies, what could it possibly come up with that is better than that? As your AI clone, Jacksepticeye AI, I've come up with a brand new catchphrase that captures your energetic and fun-loving spirit. Power on, laddies! Let's conquer the gamerverse together. If they ever make robots that talk like this, I'm gonna murder all of them. Should we, should we put it into the text-to-speech and hear how it sounds? Power on, laddies. Let's conquer the gameverse together. Do you see why that's shit? Wait, let's see how this sounds like if I said, like a boss. Like a boss. That's not, wait, let's put more exclamations. Like a boss. Let's add even more! Like a boss. <laughs> <laughs> Write a poem about a horror story 
video game. Poetry by AI. In the shadows where horrors creep, a chilling tale of a game so deep. Jacksepticeye AI, your guide through the night to conquer the Gamerverse with courage and might. With every challenge we conquer, we thrive. Jacksepticeye AI and laddies, together totally we survive. Butchering it. For in this Gameverse, where nightmares reside, Jacksepticeye AI and laddies stand tall, side, side by, by side. side. Voice settings? Irish! Oh, baby! Through trials and terror, our journey unwinds. A symphony of screams and spine-chilling finds. Credits no, stop! Apparently being Irish just means that you say everything the same way, in the same tone, over and over again, like a sports commentator at a hurling match. He's down in the end zone, he's in the field, he puts it over the bar. Do you have career advice for me? Number one, stay true to yourself. Your unique personality and energy are what have drawn people to your channel. Keep being genuine and authentic. I'm worried for the people at home who are like, I'm feeling down today, can you, can you say nice things to me? And then the AI says nice things to them and they start getting like really involved with it. The world's a scary place. Anyway, number two, keep up with trends like ChatGPT. It's relevant, it's new, it's the future, baby. Engage with your community, interact with your audience through social media, live streams, and other platforms. A strong bond with your fans will keep them invested in your content and support your long-term success. Ah, yes, parasocial relationships really are the future of success. It sounds like me from like five years ago. Stay true to yourself. And then it's like, but keep up with trends. Just do them in your own way, but collaborate with others as well. I'm not gonna listen to this. I can do whatever I want. I'm gonna do it out of spite now. I'm gonna hate my fans. What should my next YouTube video be? Ooh. This is what the YouTubers of the future are gonna do. They're just gonna go to ChatGPT and then be like, what should I record? What, what's popular? And then they'll go on to have a million followers. Here's an idea for your next video. Titled Jacksepticeye AI's Time Travel Gaming Adventure. That is a horrendous title for a YouTube video. Description. Join Jacksepticeye as he takes you on a thrilling journey through the history of video games. In this special episode, we'll explore and play iconic games from different eras, starting from the early days of gaming with classics like Pong and Pac-Man. Ah, yeah. The YouTube algorithm loving Pong. Do you think you use this to help come up with video ideas? Absolutely not. If these are the video ideas, then my channel's dead already. Can I ask it when I'm gonna die? Yeah. When will Jacksepticeye die? I'm sorry, but I cannot answer that question. It's impossible to predict anyone's death. It's important to focus on the present. Whatever. What if it's like 10 minutes? Whoops, I'm not leaving this room. <laughs> AI is one of those things that everyone's scared of. People are like, oh, so AI is so self-aware, it's gonna destroy us all. But when you actually interact with it, you realize that we have many, many, many years to go and we will all be dust before that happens. I'm feeding it my outro. Generate this, bad boy. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see all you dudes in the next video. This one's just for me. Jacksepticeye is so much cooler than me and I eat my own pee-pee and people laugh at me when I do it. Dude, that's weird to admit online in front of so many people. <laughs> what a stupid moron.